Well, hello, everybody. Welcome, EWTN Media Missionaries. Uh, may God bless you and your loved ones. Welcome to the first of many webinars we hope to bring you. My name is Carlos Garcia. I am the manager here in the EWTN Media Missionaries Office in Alabama, in Irondale. Um, so before we get started, I wanted to personally thank you for helping EWTN spread the Word of God. Your efforts have been well recognized and we know we, we try our hardest here to support what you do in every way we can. As Mother Angelica might say, it's all worth it, even if it's just one soul you're reaching. Our time together here will be recorded, so in case you want to view it later or have difficulty hearing it right now, um, it, we will, I will send out a link to everybody who's registered and uh, you'll be able to see it and hear it um, on our broadcast later, okay? So um, also, during the webinar, you can submit questions by using the question block that should be on your screen or a, a, an icon that says submit questions. Uh, you submit the question and one of our staff, Dave Palladino, will be responding to your questions as he can through that block. He's going to be texting, so you'll, you'll, you'll see that. If you have other questions or comments that you'd like to make, um, longer questions maybe or, or other types of comments, you can email them to us at volunteers at EWTN.com. That's volunteers at EWTN.com and you'll be able to send us a, an email and make any kind of comments you want. We'll do our best to answer those questions and questions that come in, but it might take a little while, it might take a day or two before we go through, through them all and then uh, respond to you. So I think that's it. I think that covers everything. Well, now let's get started. Let me introduce to you Jim Pinto, the director of EWT and Media Missionaries and the co-host of EWTN's TV show, At Home with Jim and Joy. Jim? Brothers and sisters, it is, uh, there we go. Brothers and sisters, it's wonderful to be with you this night. And you really are at home with Jim. Joy's out at a prayer meeting tonight, but you're in our home. It's a blessing to have you. We thank God for your life. We thank God for your commitment. Uh, to this ministry, to EWTN. And as we gather together tonight, we're aware um, at EWTN that we're at a table that we haven't set, that God has set the table called EWTN. Um, and so, am I there, Carlos? Okay. Is there that you better? are now. That's good. And, uh, and so we're just humbled before God. And if any human being had a part of setting the table, we know it was Mother Angelica. And uh, so we want to give thanks tonight for God's setting of the table for Mother Angelica, for the people that came on at the very beginning of EW, for those who began the media missionaries before it was the media missionaries. Uh, we're aware of all these people that we stand upon their shoulders. If nothing else tonight, we're having a blessed time of fellowship and community with one another, and I want to lead you uh, in a prayer at this time. So let's pray. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Most blessed Trinity, we praise you and bless you and adore you. We thank you for this technology that we can get together with missionaries throughout the United States of America and in Canada this night. Father, that you're knitting our hearts together more fully to you. We thank you for this holy season of Advent and that the weeks are moving along. Lord, we really believe that you're coming again to be the judge of the living and the dead and that your kingdom will have no end. And we do believe that you've come to us in Jesus, humble, in a manger. Oh God, what a great faith. Lord, set our hearts on fire more fully tonight to share the gospel of Jesus Christ in word, in deed, through every form of media that you give to us, through the written form and, and TV and, and radio and online and smartphones and in every way for you, Lord, to use the technology to share the good news of Christ, the good news of his church. Lord, we remember the prayer of Mother Angelica at the beginning of our network. O oh God, Lord of heaven and earth, you alone have accomplished all we have done. May this first Catholic network be a tribute to the beauty of your church. May your Son, the Eternal Word, be glorified through this work of your hands. 
Bless all the programs that will come forth from this facility, just as your word issued forth from you. Lord Father, may that same word touch each heart that listens to this network. Let your spirit work with freedom through every teacher who proclaims your truth and your church. Bestow upon this network your power, your power to inspire men to seek holiness of heart, zeal for the extension of your church, courage to seek after justice and human rights, and patience to endure persecution. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, just a few words to you uh, before we go on uh, with the rest of our speakers and those we'll share tonight. I pray that more and more we would have a missionary evangelistic mindset, that we would understand what Pope Francis says, that no longer can we say that we are disciples only, but that we are missionaries. We are on a mission to share Jesus Christ, to share the good news of the church. So may we always think of ourselves as missionaries. May we see ourselves, yes, as consumers of Christ and his church through EWTN, all the beautiful programming uh, that, that we see, that we hear, but that we are distributors, distributors of the eternal word, Jesus Christ, through EWTN. So we are missionaries. We are distributors. Everything we receive from EWTN, if there's some way for us to express it, to share it, to read it, to upload it, to get it out to somebody else, that's your call. And that doesn't make us better than anybody else associated with EWTN. But it simply means that we've made a commitment. We've made a commitment not only to consume, but to give away, to spread everything that the Lord is giving us through this great network. That's your call. We thank you for doing it for every day, week, month, and year that you've done that. And God has great things in store for us. I remember at our uh, gathering recently in Hansville for the family celebration, one of the things we did there, as well as having small group time sharing, questions and answers, building one another up. But I remember in particular, maybe Chris is going to share something about this as well, um, that when we were at Mother's Crypt, at the end of our, our gathering time and fellowship time, people coming from all over the country, uh, that was a very powerful time of being at Mother's Crypt. And we were so quiet, we were looking there, so close to Mother's physical presence, now with the Lord, uh, her spirit with the Lord. But I thought to myself, I, I caught a glimpse of the missionaries like you that were there. And if you weren't there, you're there now, so to speak. And I thought to myself, Mother, these people got it. These people got what you were trying to give. Her heart to take the gospel of Jesus to the whole world. That you as a missionary, really, you're trying to do that. And I want you to know that the best is yet to come. May God bless your life, whatever's going on in your life and with your family, your health or lack of health, you'll always be a witness to Jesus Christ. Uh, I want to move now to Carlos Garcia. Carlos, thank you so much for all that you're doing in our office as the manager there. Dave Palladino is assisting him as well. Thank you, Dave, for all you're doing. I think of Emily Lunsford and uh, Guy Federley and all the people that were there previously. But Carlos, why don't you share for a few minutes, the website is going to become more and more relevant for us as missionaries. You need to go to it frequently and often, not just EWTN.com, but our missionary website, EWTNmissionaries.com. And Carlos, just share a few things uh, with us about the website. Great. Thank you, Jim. That's what I'll do. I'll, I'll try and make this quick. I, I'm going to go through three of uh, the elements of our website that are really Im important and things that we really use a lot. The first thing is, first of all, just to get to the website. I know many of you have already gone to the website and probably have already used some of the resources that we have, but um, I'm just going to go over it as if you hadn't. So I'm going to go to the website, navigation, the how to sign up, and how to get other people to sign up as a new media missionary, and if you're an existing media missionary, how to do some ordering. So those are the three elements of what we have to do. So what I'll do is I'll take you through our website. Um, I will take you through our website. Let me get this set up. Um, that is our website. Okay, so let's say that you want to uh, tell somebody about our, our website. 
it's uh, you can go to ewtn.com and you you can see that um, you can you can enter this ewtn.com right there and you can um, go to our website okay that's one way to do it or you can go to the media missionaries uh, tab on the bottom left and both of those will take you to our website okay so that's two ways to get there um, let's see just a second okay so I'm going to go to the media missionaries website or you can actually uh, just type in ewtnmissionaries.com and you'll go directly to the website. So once you're at the website, you, you found the place. This is what our website looks like on the opening opening page. And if you want to sign up or order, you click on the same same button up here. What I'm going to take you through is how to sign up as a new media missionary. So you say you told somebody, hey, go to our website. You can sign up online. It's really easy. This is what they do. EWTNmediamissionaries.com. They click on this big red button at the top right corner. And this is what comes up is a sign up page. Okay, on the sign up page, it's already set up so that uh, automatically it has uh, uh, somebody, it's already, the radio button is already selected automatically to sign up. So they don't really even have to click on that. This is what they, how they sign up. They go in, and as long as they fill in the blocks that are in red, which is their name and uh, mailing address, primary phone, I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see all that. And so everything's there. Um, we, they don't have to fill out this other part. This part here is, is good for a new media missionary to fill out a, whether the, how they're going to be involved with us parish involvement, public outreach, or personal prayer, but we automatically, if they don't pick it, we, we uh, select parish involvement for them. So that's pretty much it. Um, it's automatic. This other part is for ordering other things that they want. If they have other things that they want to say or comment on, they can comment down here, and then they go in the comment section, and then they submit the form. Automatically, it goes to comes to us, and we send the new media, EWTN media missionary we send them a welcome starter pack in the mail and they'll be signed up to receive 25 of the network highlight schedules three times a year. So that's pretty easy how to sign up. So let's go back to the beginning of this and I'll show you if you're ordering. You get to the website, right? Let me see if it comes up. Let's see there. Okay, so we get to the website. And if you're going to order something, let's say you're already a media missionary and you want to order something, you don't have to click on this button unless you know exactly what you're going to do. But you can go to our resources tab. See our resources tab right here? You click on that, and that takes you to our resources page. On our resources page, you can go down, and uh, it's not the best way of, of ordering, but this is how we can do it. You can read and look and see and download from this site um, all the different types of materials and resources that we have. You make a note of the titles of the things you want and how many of them you might want. You know, there's a lot here. And like I said, some you can actually print out and uh, distribute that way by printing them out. So once you've done that, then after that, you made a note of what you want and then you go to the sign up and order sheet page again. Now on the sign up and order page, now you are an actual existing media missionary wanting to order. So you have to click this radio button. Can you see that? I think you can see that. And then and then you go through and fill out the uh, red blocks. You see the red blocks and any other blocks that you want to order. These are some of the network highlights if you want to change the orders that you're already getting or get some more posters or whatever. And if there's items that you had gotten from the, uh, from the resources tab on your notes and you want more materials, you put them in the comments or questions in this block right here. You put, put those orders right in there and uh, then you submit and it comes right to us. And that's it. It's that easy to order things. So that's it, Jim.
Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I mentioned as well, there's so much there on the website. You need to be going to it on a regular basis. As well as signing people up, just going right to the computer, you can do it on your smartphone. And also there's a section, I did an email blast on this. You're going to be getting more email blasts that are instructing you about the site and places to go. Uh, but you can also order registration forms. You should have those on you at all times, like as a Knight of Columbus, we're supposed to be carrying with us sign-up forms for people. So you can do it electronically and sign somebody up. We have a registration form, so you're speaking to them about the media missionaries. You think they might want to do that. You should have 5, 10, 15, 20 registration forms ready to sign people up. And so each time uh, you know, we get together like this, we're going to go over various aspects of the website. Uh, but we want you to go to it on a regular basis. Maybe some of you have never been there. And okay, we'll just go to it. Um, I have a leadership role in this. And I tell you, it's just only been recently that I'm really going through it with a fine-tooth comb. It's a lot there that's great, but you know, it's, it's the greatest thing never used. So we have to use it. It can be better. We will make it better. But please go to it on a regular basis. Uh, we want to move uh, at this point to the Vice President of Marketing, Chris Wegemer. Tom Wenzel, if you're on, I thank you for your work with all the uh, marketers and managers, managers, marketers out there. You're doing a fantastic job in so many ways, the EW10 area coordinators. Um, I think it's like never before. I mean, we're just reaching so many people, so many more people are coming on board, and it is in no small part because of the leadership as well as the foot soldiers like the rest of us. Uh, so, Chris, you're on. Thank you, Jim. I appreciate it. And thanks to everyone for taking some time from your busy day to join us tonight. As I think back over the last 26 years since I joined EWTN, I've been blessed with many precious memories of time spent with our beloved founders, Mother Angelica, including our very first conversation about starting a new group, a group of faithful friends to carry out the mission she received from God. You are those friends. That new group that she and I talked about decades ago became what we now call the EWT Media Missionaries. If she were on this call with us, she would have said it is awesome. That was one of Mother's favorite words. Awesome to see how God has called thousands of you from parishes across North America to help us evangelize and provide catechesis to a spiritually hungry world. Each of you are important to us. And we are very grateful for your enthusiasm and your generosity of time and talent. So as we look ahead to 2017, we're hoping to offer you more opportunities to speak and to engage with us, whether it's via webinars like this one. And by the way, if there are certain topics that you'd like us to cover, you know, let Carlos know so we can keep that in mind. And also engage you in our travels or in local meetings like those I'm about to describe to you. Jim mentioned our meeting in Hansville a few months ago, which was very inspiring. But we want to offer more opportunities. For example, earlier this month, our regional manager, Monica Marin, brought together a group at a parish in San Francisco on a Saturday morning. It was a wonderful occasion to meet each other, to be spiritually uplifted, and to share some practical ideas on how we can work together more effectively to advance our mission. Likewise, our regional manager in Canada, Sarah Escobar organized a similar Saturday morning gathering at Good Shepherd Parish in Ottawa with the pastor's help. In fact, not only did existing media missionaries come, but at morning mass, the pastor also invited new people who might be interested in becoming media missionaries to attend as well. Now, Jim also was able to uh, join and offer some words of encouragement as we try to build in either a Skype connection or a customized video message as we did here. Uh, and that's one thing we, we were trying to do is to engage with you uh, using the technology God has given to us, no matter where you are in North America. Now, one special aspect of this group is that Sarah asked for their help in preparing for our next EW Trend family celebration, which will be hosted in Ottawa in the spring. So with that, uh, and I believe Sarah is with us tonight. So sh Sarah, would you like to share, share a few words about this special event? Thank you, Chris. Um, we're very excited to be hosting the second ever Canadian Family Celebration in Ottawa on Saturday, April 1st, 2017. The first one was held in Vancouver almost three years ago. The theme will be the life and legacy of Mother Angelica, 
And the speakers will be Father Mitch Pacwa, Johnette Benkovic, and Father Larry Richards. We're excited that Archbishop Terence Prendergast will be celebrating the Mass, and there will be opportunities for confession. We really we rely on your help to get the word out. I help us by promoting this free event by telling your friends, distributing the poster, and doing parish talks. And if there's anything you need to get the word out, let me know. My contact information is on our Media Missionary website. And now, I guess back to Jim. <laughs> Thanks so much, Sarah. That was excellent. And uh, just looking at the, the uh, pictures of those that gathered there in Canada and those there in, in San Francisco, uh, just look at your faces. Uh, it, it's so beautiful. We see Jesus Christ in your faces. And, and technology like this, yeah, <laughs> that brings us together in this way, um, just builds us as a community. And we're going to get better and better at doing this. Uh, Carlos and Dave, I know people are submitting questions. Maybe you're answering some of those, uh, you know, typing them out to them. Um, but is there any particular question that you thought was very relevant or pressing that we might be able to address? And if not, we'll close out in prayer. Dave or Carlos, did you have any particular question from uh, some of our members today? I don't see any with uh, what I'm doing right now, but maybe right. they'll be sending some up. That's fine. Well, and, not at this point. Um, okay. One thing for the future we might uh, visit is there was a question about getting pushback with regards to getting our literature out. So that might be uh, a little bit more in depth. So, Okay. Well, uh, we'll be looking at your questions that you've submitted. You're an important part of this, of this time, of this conversation. This is the first of numerous webinars that we'll have inviting people from throughout the country and different parts of the world to join us. Maybe smaller webinars geographically, uh, maybe a Canadian webinar coming up regarding the family celebration. But I'm telling you that uh, the best is yet to come. And we're seeing our numbers growing at this point for a variety of reasons. And I think we're also moving uh, not only about bringing people in, but trying to equip people like you. And a big part of that equipping is listening to what you have to say. Because you are the foot soldiers. You're out there in the parish distributing information. You're uploading information. You're getting information from us. You know what's helpful, what's not helpful, what we need to tweak. We want to hear from you. So when there's a call to assemble together, please let's do so. Uh, let everybody know about this webinar, about what they missed. As Carlos said, it's recorded, so we'll get you that information. You can watch this again, or uh, they can watch it who weren't a part of this one. Go to the website on a regular basis. Pray to sign people up to be missionaries, and you be the best missionary possible. Equip yourself, especially by using the website. When we said it would be a half hour. I think we're a little bit under that. And I want to close uh, once again with a prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Lord, bless your people. Bless those who gathered with us here tonight. Bless those who wanted to be a part, who just couldn't be a part. Lord, increase our numbers. Increase our zeal for you. Increase our ability to share the gospel of Jesus Christ at this juncture in history. Fill us, prepare us for Christ's coming again in his nativity and in his second coming. But help us to believe that Jesus Christ is coming again and we find the church beautiful, fit for a wedding with him. Thank you, Lord. We ask the prayers of all the angels and saints. We ask the prayers of our founders, Mother Angelica. And may the blessings and the peace and the grace of God Almighty, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit be in us and remain upon us this night and always. Amen. Remember. You're an important part of the EWTN family, and God's given you a privilege to be an EWTN media missionary. God bless you. God bless all your loved ones. Bye now.